Hey guys, just want to do a quick video on uh, Lacroix's jaws. I just want to see how it was uh, made on the inside. Um, so it's a 12S4P. These are molly cells. Molly cells. Um, the only thing I find a little bit, a little bit worried is they put a double-sided tape here to secure the battery uh, P groups. I'm not sure if that's a great idea or not. <laughs> Um, there is like a PCB, so, um, PCB, sort of like a battery bar or something here. And then I think it's got plastic, uh, battery holder. But other than that, there's not really protection. I guess, I guess the case, it's, uh, the battery enclosure definitely protects. It's, it's pretty tough. Um, but yeah, pretty good design. It's got the Storm uh core 60d and you got a bms and i think they do bypass uh pretty sure they do bypass bms you can see the negative terminal and the uh positive terminal going straight into the bms which i think is a great um design factor for uh, e-skateboards because you don't want the bms cutting off power in the middle of going like 30 miles per hour um yeah, pretty neat. I just wanted to take a look at what it looks like. Now, the Nos Nosare, the one with 12S10P, is basically the same case, same everything, but you got 10 uh, batteries across, all right? Uh, and it's basically 12, um, 12, forming 12, all right? And I think it's actually dual, dual, du um, double layer. So for 12S10P, uh, you're gonna need a 10 batteries uh, instead of the four batteries here uh, to form a 10p and then you got 10p 10p um, 6 12 so yeah looks pretty cool um, yeah pretty cool design I just want to take a look and yeah I just want to share that with you guys what it looks like on the inside of a, uh, a Lacroix jaws i just got this so i'll have a full review but for right now um just want to take how it was made see ya